Winter is the time most of us think of as cold and flu season. But in fact, those bad bugs are around us 12 months a year. Yeah, so keeping our immune systems healthy is really a year-round job. And we've been looking into some interesting new research about how to do that. The research that's come out of NIH has really been profound because it's shown us that the, the two parts of the echinacea plant will decrease the frequency of colds. Carrie Marshall is a naturopathic physician who closely monitors the latest developments in herbal and botanical medicine. She found particular significance in a five-year federal study on the immune-boosting benefits of echinacea, especially the polysaccharides in its flowers and leaves. They have an immune stimulatory effect, so it actually will decrease the frequency of cold. So if we're looking at a person who is stressed out, meaning they don't get enough sleep, they are working too much, they have kids, they're not eating three solid meals and lots of fruits and vegetables in their diet, that's a person who's going to be prone to getting more colds. And so if you provide them with immune polysaccharides, such as echinacea, the aerial parts of echinacea, then that will actually enable them to not get sick as often. The research cited by Dr. Marshall was conducted by Gaia Herbs, an organic herbal supplement company in North Carolina. It was funded by NCAM, the National Center for Complementary and Alternative Medicine, and the study found that echinacea has two very different health benefits. The roots, when harvested in the fall, yield alkalamides that can quickly reduce the duration and severity of colds and respiratory problems. The flowering tops, when harvested in the spring, release polysaccharides that stimulate and boost the immune system on an ongoing basis. And these chemicals have been found in vitro to be very highly immunosupportive. And the way they do that is by um, the, the, the effects on the natural um, immune cells within the body. The findings from the NCAM study have been made available in a number of botanical and natural medicine journals. Scalzo says consumers need to know that the science supporting echinacea is growing. But he also acknowledges that echinacea has been the subject of some debate. There is conflicting information about echinacea in the media and amongst the scientific community. There's no doubt about it. We've heard it, we've, we've read about it, and it, it, it is true, it exists. And I think the problem with that conflicting information is just what we're speaking about here. The, the distinctions have not been made to date between the different parts of echinacea and the different chemistries of echinacea and how they are used and applied in study design. Scalzo says he's confident that echinacea, properly harvested and formulated, can reduce the number and severity of colds and respiratory problems throughout the year by building our immune system. But finding an echinacea product that can deliver those benefits is not easy, given the profusion of products on the market. Scalzo recommends consulting an experienced herbalist, a health food store professional who's been trained in herbal preparations, or a naturopathic physician like Carrie Marshall. And then this is the formula that I told you about that will actually be probably the best formula for you to help prevent colds. It's the one that is geared towards people who are under stress, under physical, emotional stress. So it's one that you can take a couple of capsules just a couple times a day. Scalzo says echinacea is increasingly being grown with organic farming methods, which enhance its purity, and he says it's safe for children as well as adults. But even though echinacea is one of the top-selling herbs in the country, he says much more can still be done with it to build our immune systems all year long. It's good to know that finally science is digging deeper into mm -hmm. natural ways of keeping our immune system strong. Absolutely right. The research is really starting to get pretty deep in this area, so that means there's lots of information, which also means that for the average consumer, they need to be careful. They need to look at those labels, they have a question about whether or not they're getting the right thing, they shouldn't hesitate to ask somebody like an herbalist or a natural products uh, expert to make sure they are buying the product that's really going to help their immune system stay strong.